Cool, man. Um, alrighty. So, in your hometown, what's is it? Denmark is your hometown, or I'm in Copenhagen. 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 Yeah. Oh yeah, Denmark's yeah. the country. Silly me. That's right. Uh, so in <laughs> Copenhagen, uh, yeah. what's your go-to restaurant there? What's your go-to uh, order in your go-to restaurant? How's that? Yeah, it's it's a pizza place called Gorm's Gorm's Pizza, okay. uh, and it is it is simply the best pizza I've ever had. It's so good, and we we both ordered the same pizza. Oh um, really? Yeah, it's what is it? So it's uh, it's a it's called Salumi Salumi, okay. and, and it's like um, it's this you know huge Italian I guess sauce. It's really thinly sliced uh-huh. and. Uh, Oh, it's so good. Oh. Um, yeah. All righty. Really unique crust. So, like wow. that. <laughs> That's where we go going when I come visit you. Uh, yes. For sure. For sure. Yeah. Um, what's something that you are curious about right now? Um, I'm always curious about space. And okay. it's something completely different from what I do every day. It's but, a good thing to be uh, curious about. Space exploration is is a big hobby of an interest really? of mine that I follow. Yeah, very closely. Wow. So do you like whenever there's like a comet coming through, you kind of know where to look, and uh, yeah. are you that kind of geeky in it? That kind of geek, following uh, rocket launches. Okay. Uh, Elon and, Musk and yeah, hundred percent. Oh yeah. man, that hey, guys love that. Love all that. Crazy. I can't. Uh, that's a, that's a, that's a little. That's like the the, the distraction in my life. You know, that's just com- has nothing to do with anything on earth. Or yeah, 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 yeah. That I do every day. So yeah. I really. I, that's that's something. On it's good to have things like that. Oh man, that's so that's yeah. cool. I didn't know that about you. Very cool. Yeah, space um, nerd. So <laughs> that being said, yeah, what's something I should have asked you but didn't? Uh, um. That's a great question. I think you ask really good questions. <laughs> um, I mean, um, yeah, I don't know. Um, maybe uh, some of the we couldn't probably dive. We could maybe dive more into our, our refugee project uh, that that could have. Yeah, um, yeah. Maybe be something we could have talked more about. But uh, I guess well, I, I mean, spent too much time talking about me. something else. <laughs> and that's passionate for me because. So we'll yeah. have to talk about that. We'll have to get yeah. you on again because I'd love to talk more about obviously the work yeah. with you belong and what we're doing, yeah. And like just that. the, I mean, when we talk about vulnerable people and human trafficking and what there's mm-hmm. seventy million exactly. refugees um, in the world yeah. today and and yeah. just human yeah. migration in general, from whether it be climate yeah. change or so many other things, there's so much to yeah. look at. Um, exactly. I think there's a big one, and I, 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 uh, I think we ran, we probably ran out of time, but uh, and yeah. I kind of went in another direction when that, and when that opportunity was there, but so um, that would have been cool to talk about. All yeah. right, cool. All right, so that's noted. Uh, we got another episode out of you to, to talk about that. That's cool. Um, what's something you've recently failed at? <laughs> Um, sleeping, uh, uh, exercise. <laughs> but you're succeeding at being a dad, so uh, I think goodness. all those things um, are well worth am, failing at. <laughs> I, I don't do. I'm just the worst napper. I don't do naps. I change nappies. You know what I mean? Yeah. That, that's that's me. But I, I'm just not the. I'm so terrible at sleeping well. Uh, I would say I would say the screens have taken over my life way too much at the okay. moment. That's something I want to change. Uh, I feel like um, that's a good one. I feel like it's it's gone too far. So yeah. I need a I need a break from too much from the screen. Zoom and well, else. I mean that's part of my job, and so hmm. I can't really. That's that's how we can communicate, and and that's needed. But I would just say the small screens, uh, hmm. my phones, uh, on my phone, and and it, it just. All the other screen time, all the uh, if, if I'm you know yeah. staring too much at the screen, um, and I feel like that's that's a that's something I'm failing at, at the moment. Screen time, I want to I want to change that. So yeah, cool man. I can I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna take note of that and make some practical changes too. I think. I think mm. you're spot on, I, man. I think <laughs> just it's just been a deal. We've been we we've, we've been. You know, it's all been about the screen. Following it's the news, so easy. The next... We're locked in. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, and we've only been able to connect on social media. And so it's kind of almost inevitably happened in this season. But I, I don't think it has to be like that ongoing. So sure. I want to make a change. Good one. Um, 
What do you wish you'd known when you started? Ah, oh, it's a tough one. Um, in a way, I I don't know that I would want to know what was ahead because I don't think I would have made it. I don't think I would have wow. jumped into it. I knew. That is a uh, good answer. Oof. So if I knew what lied ahead, I don't think I would have made it or, or done it. Um, and so, of course, you can you can you can say all kinds of things that would have been helpful in the season sure. and, and so on. Uh, I think um, I think confidence would be one. Mm. You know, just just knowing that you have something to bring and don't look down on what on yourself um, and and what's in your hand. Mm-hmm. I mean, you can do amazing things and. And I, I'm one of those who believe that if you have been given the opportunity, you, you're you likely also graced for it. And so even though it feels outside of your ability, sure. outside of your whatever, if, if you give it your best, then mm. something good can come out of it. And I think, yeah, I just had really low self-confidence, a uh, really low confidence. Um, you know, really what you want is not self-confidence, but godly confidence. Um, because anything with self in it is usually not going to be enough. But um, yeah, uh, that would have been one believing in that that you're in the right place and you have something Good. to contribute. Yeah, love it. Good stuff. Um, who's someone you look up to that inspires you? You. Huh? you. Oh, you. <laughs> no, I'm I'm serious. You are. Um, oh, dude. I think Come there's on. lots of great people that I look up to in different ways. Um, you know. Uh, when I think about, um, but but I'm, I'm serious. When when okay. when I think about you know loving people and being brave and courageous, I think of you, uh, and 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 you insp- you you inspire me like that. Um, and you know, there's lots of. I, I mean, I I love uh, Nick Nick Kane, who is our founder, yeah. and this is not a suck up, but he no. is just he's an incredible man um, and an I incredible agree. father. I agree. Um, the way that he has raised his, his daughters and so on that that's a that's mm-hmm. a father that's a, a, an example of a father that that uh, I look up to in a great way. And so I think there's different people in different ways um, mm-hmm. that inspires me. But you are um, definitely one of them. Well, wow. well, I certainly wasn't expecting that, but um, <laughs> Phil, thank you. I, I mean that. I, I well, and I I will. I will receive it and thank you <laughs> for saying that, man. Um, I appreciate that a lot, man. Well, the last question mm-hmm. is, and I think you've kind of alluded to it um, yeah. in today, but why does why does justice matter to you? Yeah, justice matters to me I, um, because I think it should matter to all of us. Mm. Um, you know, Martin Luther King said famously, "And justice." anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere and 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 we are in that way Mm. all connected to this and um you know if i would go so far to say that if we don't think it relates to us then we are living a fairly we are are living in ignorance Mm. Uh, and i i i was living like that i didn't think Mm. that it was something that was part of my my life and i just hadn't realized how my life could be connected to it sure and i'm in no way saying that people like i said before in the interview and move to some other country or sure, quit your yeah. job or whatever but we all play a part in that so 100%. justice matters to me because i could have been the one yeah that were, were living under injustice might as well uh and so um I wanna. I wanna. The fact that I don't. I wanna use that as uh, to help others. 